Hi, so I'm going to create a moment connection here. So what I need to do is I'll go this way. So what I'm going to do is these connections basically have to go the whole way around this job. All the members are the same sizes, basically, and the columns same sizes. So just a simple copy this around. So what I'm going to do first is we well we can do it afterwards i guess it doesn't really matter i'll do it now so what i'm going to do is i'm going to select this and then i'm going to come in here and i'm just going to do the basic copy i'm going to select the column the beam okay and so this is going to help me create the opposite one and then i'm going to copy that and i'm going to do column beam okay so we're good so we got the second one set up so now I'm going to go back to 2D wireframe. We're going to go down to the third tab down for custom connections. And we're going to select this one here. And two beams. And I'm going to select the column as the first beam. And the beam as the second beam. I'm going to name it Moment 1, I'll call it. Or I have a couple of names in already for other ones. Right one. Because it's on the right hand side of the column. Select the parts. I'm going to select all these parts on the top. I'm going to select these. I'm going to select the weld. So I'm going to do the same on the bottom. I'm going to select all those. So that's the plate, the weld, and the bolts on the bottom, the top, and then the web. And now, importantly, we need to select the cutback on the beam. And here we're going to do column. So this is what, when you copy this command or when you activate this command, it's going to, these are your input beams. So this is going to be the beam. You can see it's highlighted in red. Okay. And there it's created the box. All right. So now we can't just copy from that box right now we firstly need to create it again so let's go in here moment right one okay and then we just select it'll tell you down here select the column select the beam it's also telling you on the screen because i have the dynamic input and allow objects modification and there you go there's your connection so what I'm going to do now is I can copy that around. So what I'll do is we'll go back here and we'll copy it as a group. And then we're going to go column, beam, column, uh, beam is in here. Is there a beam in here? Yeah, there's the beam. Beam, column, beam. And this one has a connection on it, which I need to delete. So I won't do that right now. I'll go back here to the center. And I'll add these ones here. So as you can see, it's pretty simple, right? So we'll do another one here. Another one here. Yeah, so I clicked something wrong there, so don't worry about that. We can go back and delete that one. And we'll just keep going. Whatever I clicked on. So let's go back. You can just click on a part of that and delete that. So I guess I clicked on a beam by accident. So let's click on this again. Let's just make sure we don't have a mistake. Sorry. Sometimes I press the right button for enter. You don't need to do that with these connections. Make sure you select the blue box or else you're only going to take one part of the connection. Column, beam. Okay, that worked that time. So now to do the other side, I'm going to go in here. And we're going to do the same thing, basically. And I'll just do it quickly because I've already done it. So I'll just go in here, create new connection, two beams. I'm going to select this beam, this column, this beam. I'm going to call it moment left one. And here I'm going to select the parts of D. 
these parts. I'm going to select the bolts, the plate, the weld here. I'm going to select everything on the bottom and select your cut again. Right click. I'm going to go in here and do column. And we're going to go in here and we're going to do beam. And there's your blue box. Select your blue box. Oh no, sorry. Remember, first one, I believe you need to create. You need to come in and create it properly first. So, column, beam. There you go. Uh, I, let me go back into that. Allow object modification. Select this. And then just copy that around again. Same as we did before. So, just go column, beam, and so on. Hope that helps there in five minutes, basically. You can do it in quicker than five minutes. You can do all your, like, a typical or a difficult connection like that. No problem. Hope that helps. All right.